It happened in seconds. I was scared for my life. Tom Donahue pulls up to his neighborhood gas station in Southeast, gets out of the car, gets back in when a car pulls up behind him and blocks him. An armed and masked suspect then runs towards his car with a gun, but Donahue wasn't alone. His dog Dusty was in the back seat. I don't know life without Dusty. Anybody that knows me knows Dusty is my life. Thankfully, the person with the gun let him open the back door to set his dog free. Call it him having a heart, calling it whatever it is. He did the right thing by letting me get the dog out. The two now happily together. Donahue now hoping whoever is responsible for what happened to them to be held accountable. I think that now as a couple days have gone by and the, the fact that he had a gun and that with a pull of it so quickly I could have been gone brings a new reality to life. A reality far too many people in D.C. have faced. According to D.C. police, there have been 268 carjackings this year, up 57 percent compared to last. Donahue says he didn't think he would be next until he was. It can happen to me. It can happen to anybody. Donahue says someone did find his car, which he now has back. D.C. police say they do not have a suspect at this time. At D.C. police headquarters, Colby Satterfield, WUSA 9.